We should remember that he had a, a, a deep and varied career. He was in a number of postings, but as you say, his last posting and the one that everybody remembers him for <laughs> is the Washington uh, posting. But he did become uh, uh, the head of the Press Complaints um, Commission as well. Um, and he was very much a gifted communicator. And he was a great friend of GB News, as you probably know. He appeared <laughs> on many shows, particularly with Alistair Stewart, his great friend. So we didn't see the end of him, even if he had left for Foreign office. I think that's the important no, point. No, absolutely not. When I talk about the ostracism, this doesn't mean that the man stopped contributing. What yes. it meant is, is Christopher, in a sense, remade his career, mm. having spent so much time in the foreign office. He then spent it commentary, writing at the Press Complaints Commission. But what I think the loss was is we lost a skilled diplomat at a key time for Britain and the world, because, of course, the world didn't stop with the Iraq war in 2003. The aftermath of that conflict caused great tension in U.S.-U.K. relations. We have had tension in U.K.-European relations, as you know. And the fact is, is that Sir Christopher was, he was a great communicator, but he was a communicator with wit, and he was also a great listener. He could read people, and he could work with people. And one of the reasons why he had been so effective in Washington before the Iraq war debacle is, he got along with the Americans. And my countrymen can be quite quirky. As he himself said after his first experience of America, this isn't Britain. This is a mysterious place. But he got to know it, and he got to know people like Donald Rumsfeld, Condoleezza Rice, George Bush himself, because as you know, an ambassador is not only representing the country, he's not only a diplomat, he's always carrying out public relations. And the skill of Christopher Meyer was he could both speak effectively but he could also observe effectively as well.